How's it going everyone? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. And today we're going to continue, or rather we're going to, I shouldn't say we're going to start a tradition because the first time I made a video like this, which was Nutcracker Strikeout, was actually two days ago and a year. Two days and a year ago. So this is the second time I've done Nutcracker Strikeout. And I would have done it more, but probably we didn't have three Nutcracker uh, skins back then. So we're going to continue the tradition with the Nutcracker Strikeout. We got Nutcracker Bodvar. We got Nutcracker Cassidy. And of course, we got Nutcracker Val. We're going to switch up the colors and the order of the skins every single game just to make it fun. And uh, yeah, have some fun with this because I don't use this team. Ever. I only do this during the Brawlhalla Winter Holiday event. So let's have some fun with it, shall we? Alright, we got our first match going against DJ Annihilation. I, I, whenever I see Reveler or like Great Witness or any of those titles, I always think that's their name at first. I'm still getting used to it like a month later. Alright. Good luck, sir. You get the future spirit Artemis Lance. Boom! Bear paw! Boom! Oh, didn't get the second bear paw. Ho ho ho! Boom! Gosh, I love that. And also, two of these legends, uh, Bodvar and Cassidy, have hammer. Which is important to me because the new legend coming out in January also has hammer and so we're trying to train up for that if you know what I mean he really was waiting for that axe down air that I'm assuming that's his uh, primary like attack mode or move I should say So, if I throw some hammer nares, we should just be able to destroy him. Cassidy is a really underrated legend. She really is. Boom! Oh. Oh my gosh, I can't hit that. Was really expecting her to do the bow neutral sig. Alright, well. GG, GG. That was a good first match. Alright, um, let's start it out. We didn't even get to use Val, so I'm going to start it out with Val. Then we'll go uh, Bodvar, then Cassidy. But let's switch up the colors. Let's do Gala colors. Those look super good. I wish, guys, I know that I'm probably in the minority on this, but I do wish that you could do Strikeout in Ranked. Because I would love that a lot more than the regular, like, Ranked 1v1, if they had Strikeout Ranked 1v1. I don't know why, but I just love the concept of picking three different Legends and having to use all three. I like regular 1v1 too, but Strikeout is just a different thing. I'm not saying it's better or worse or anything like that. I just say I wish they had a rank uh, queue for it. Bye bye. You did. You did. You did. You did. It don't matter how many strings you hit me with. If I bop you on the head and break your recovery off stage, you're going to die. Ooh, that was a good one. 
I tried to get her with the neutral, but she just slid right through me. All right, we got Bonevar again. Shoop. She knew she was dead as soon as I hit that recovery. Bonus points if I can hit the hammer neutral sig and kill with it, all right? I'm trying. Oh, that wasn't it. That wasn't even the right move. Oh, come on. Let me hit you with that neutral sig. No, no, no. All right, that works. GG, dude, GG. Bouncy. All right, um, I didn't really get to use Val that much, so, I mean, I did, but it didn't, so I'm gonna do Val again first, and then we'll go to Cassidy, and then Bodvar. This time we'll do Black. All right, going against Zaf, S-Z-N. He's got Nash, Orion, and Yumiko. All right, that'll be fun. Right off the bat, we got Nash versus Val. Also, it's like Team White versus Team Black, kind of. I don't know if he's using white or gala colors. I think white. Hard to tell, though. That does so much damage! Not getting this weapon, Nash. Don't even think about it. Oh. Never mind. That should do it. Just deleted that Orion. Just completely interrupted that. Boom! GG, dude, GG. Another three stock, or was that our first three stock? I don't remember. GG, dude, GG. Val is probably my best out of the Nutcracker squad. Um, so, alright, we'll use her last. Budvar's probably my, well, I don't know, Cassidy and Budvar are probably tied. They're both, I'm pretty decent with both of them. So, we'll go Cassidy, Budvar, and we'll leave Val for, for last. Um, uh, because, honestly, like I said, if, if I play Val first, we may not even get to see the other ones, because I'm pretty decent with the gauntlets and sword on Val. Alright, here we go. Ooh, a scythe user... We got Orb, we got Lance, we got... He, man, he's got a little bit of everything on his team. In fact, he's got six different weapons, I think. Two, one, That's pretty cool. Or no, the Spear, I guess, Orion and Mirage. All right, um, right, I'll let him get a weapon.
Wow, that just hit so hard. I mean, she was only in yellow. How'd that feel? Hammer, I'm getting better with just because I've been practicing with it more. I should not have just chilled underneath his, uh, down helicopter, but oh, okay, GG dude, GG. I I thought he could get back there, but I guess not. All right, um, we'll do one more game. One more game. I love the Nutcracker Strikeout. Like I said, I only do this once a year, so we'll do one more game. Um, I'll start it out with Bodvar, Cassidy, and then uh, Val. And we're gonna do Winter Holiday colors on the final, on the final match. If you guys enjoy this type of content, please uh, drop a like. Consider subscribing. I'm also I'm always putting out this kind of content. I usually drop a code to unlock a Brahalla item in the comments after every video. So. Just a little uh, gift from me to you. All the extra codes I get, I always give to you guys. All right, going against the Jay Yun. I actually didn't see who I didn't see who his uh, next characters were gonna be. So, let's go get your weapon, boy. Yeah, you like that bear paw, don't ya? How about you come back on stage? Oh my goodness! We didn't even touch each other! That was such a... That was such a bad, like, sequence for both of us. And again, that was just a bad sequence for me. Like it was a good and bad. Killed him, killed myself. Didn't need to kill myself. Okay, dude. That that was just a terrible match. That all right. You know what? One more game. One more. That that was terrible. That was just a terrible match in general. Like, yeah, we won, but like I did so many sloppy plays in my opinion. So let's do a, let's do one more. Nothing against the dude I was playing against. Nothing against him. It, I'm talking about me. It was bad for me by my standards. All right, going against uh, Lord Brox, Scarlet, and Zul. It's like they get harder and more stronger the, the more it goes. All right. Zul, especially, it's, it's going to be a tough one. All right. All right. He might be dead with that. Maybe not.
But I am no Oh Oh Man, I gotta give him a lot of props, like, I probably should have died a while ago. But then again, so, so should he. Oh my goodness, I just realized we have like the same side sig. Do you guys realize that? Oh, I'm still alive, how am I still alive? Right in the face. Oh! <laughs> she picked up the weapon, did the side sink, but it was too slow. Uh-oh. Hold that, thank you. Okay, this is this is gonna be tough. Basically one hit from Zul and I'm dead. Yep. Alright, nutcracker Cassidy. Lucky for us, we saved the best for last. I mean, Val's my, my strongest, and we're not even there yet. Oh man, he could have killed me like completely there. GG dude, GG. And there's the rage quit. All right, that was Nutcracker Squad. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. Wow, Val has green eyeballs. I just realized that, interesting. And uh, yeah, hope to see you guys in the next video. As always, this is Lucian Zor. Take it easy, guys.